The Hidden Gems of Cebu, also called Mini Boracay, that many tourists want to come and witness the beauty and bounty of Bantayan Island. Bantayan Island is made up of three municipalities of the province. One of those is Santa Fe. Santa Fe boasts of its beautiful sunrise and famous for its wide stretch of fine white sand beach. Tricycle and motorbikes are the main mode of transportation around the island. The present-day world is marked by important discrepancies in the development of language and culture. The fact that there is language death and language survival, it is important to know the social changes affecting our language's choices. Language and culture are interrelated and inseparable phenomena. Language cannot be studied without the concern of culture and vice versa. Pichong, <laughs> Dangit, dangit ya pun sudah. Ya pun turun. Karena kalau tindok lain ang dilis, lain latang, lain dua mana kelasi? Mau gas. Gurayan, naik gurayan tak naik bulinau dua nasi. As technology changes from time to time, Bantayan language tries to keep the nativity of their pure Binisaya language or Cebuano Binisda on their place. Santa Fe Hanum people use the two different terminologies to describe the Lapu Lapu. The two terminologies originated from Samar, Warai language, and Cebu, Cebuano language. The province of Samar uses Zuno to describe Lapu Lapu fish, and the province of Cebu uses Pugapo to describe it. Although Pugapo cannot be considered as a loon word, because people in Santa Fe claims that their historical language is considered as fewer language. Moreover, there is an example of language survival of their so long native tongue. Masabta na mo ng inyo istorya, pero kamo dili kamo kasabot sa amo istorya. In order to survive, a language must have a function. That the whole point of a language is an able communication and the more universally we can communicate the more dynamic our cultures will be in Cebuano terms it only has the root word saag which means stray Moreover, if you add an affix on, on the root word, it will become Saagan, which means in the Binisaya Dictionary, the word Saagan remains its meaning, stray, but in Bantayonan terms, it means morning. Thus, in locutors in Santa Fe, borrow the word Saag in Binisaya but change its meaning. The word Saagan, therefore, is an example of lone shift. Loan shift is adapting native words to the new meanings. The flourishing of language arbitrariness is visible nowadays. In Bantayan Island, the municipality of Santa Fe in particular is one of the best examples to define this. Due to the popularity of the fine white beaches in Santa Fe, Different tourists come and go with living marks to this place. Thus, acculturation happens within Mantayan Island. Mantayan Island 
was also colonized by Spanish endeavors for 333 years. Thus, without contradiction, Santa Fe Hannon also had some terminologies from Spanish. An example of this is the word quibido, which means sunglasses or shades. The word's etymology is from quibido, which also means the same in Santa Fe. Thus, this quibido word is an example of loan word. Loanword adoptions are an emergent phenomenon of language and content. The Bantayan language is mostly a mixture of different neighboring Visayan languages. The principally native Cebuano from Cebu and Eastern Negros and Hiligaynon from Western Negros and Iloilo, Buholano from Bohol, Masbateño from Masbate, and Waray Waray from Leyte and Summer. However, each municipality has its own distinct manner of uttering words and different terminologies. For example, Santa Fe Hanon described the tone of Antayan language as Lanai, which means not too slow but not too fast. It could also be called as an average tone, while the Santa Fe Han described their speaking speed as the same in Cebu City. Since the municipality of Santa Fe occupies the southeastern portion of Antayan Island, the island's airport and principal ferry port are both located within the municipality which is considered the gateway to Bantayan and its islands. Thus, Santa Fe Hanon maintained their speaking speed as fast as Cebu City to entertain well the tourists. Although the island has different loon words, it has its famous coined words which are Kapiop, Yesterday, Sara, Today, and Buas, Tomorrow. These words are only found and heard in Bantayan Island with three consecutive municipalities, Bantayan, the largest municipality covering the center part, Maridijos covering the northern portion, and Santa Fe covering the eastern portion. Languages in contact influence each other in various ways. One language can be more influential than the other as the result of linguistic and non-linguistic factors. According to Cristal, languages express identity. Because languages are repositories of history, because languages contribute to the sum of human knowledge, because languages are interesting in the themselves. How do you find Cebu, man? I love it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, we, we like it. How are the people? They are friendly. Love them. Uh -huh. okay, too well. Yeah, I wish we could talk. Well, you talk English, so that's good. Cebu, the city's got more. But our Every language is characterized by variation within the speech community that uses it. The resulting speech varieties are more or less divergent from one another. These divergent varieties are often referred to as dialects.